has got to love it, right? Blazer. <laughs> the Bison Blazer. The Jennifer Lopez. She always wears a blazer. She looks sharp. So here we are, fifth set. North Dakota State, South Dakota, Coyotes, Bison, Summit League Tournament. Four and five, it's been everything that we expected. And it's a short game. We're only playing a 15. None of this going to 25 business unless needed. Of course, we can always play extra, but it's first to 15, and we're gonna switch sides at eight. So Madison Harms becoming the all-time leader in the Summit League in blocks, 665. <laughs> Won't get a block there. Point to the Yokes. And Jennifer Lopez, I think, doesn't like it. She's going to reach for that card, and she's going to show it. Challenge point one. Challenge on the first <laughs> point. Every point matters. Oh. Both coaches showing no fear going to that challenge card early. So the call was no touch point, South Dakota. Bison are saying, oh, no. Madison Arms touched it, and we're going to challenge the first point. <laughs> Ali Bart there, ooh, yeah, yeah. might have might have got a hand on it. Ali Bart there on the swing for the Bison. Take another look here to see if there's any sort of misdirection. See the quick set there from Kelly Johnson. Yeah, my, I think it might have hit that left hand from that angle, but uh, you can't really trust no. my word for much. <laughs> I'm 0 for 2 today. I, I think it's so hard to be conclusive. I think uh, unless... Right, right, the call yeah. on the floor was out so it yeah. has to be clear and try what, what do they always say in, in the nfl clear uh, inconclusive is the word but there's yes. like clear and present evidence whatever there you go um that uh, harm's got a hand on it to me i'll take a stab at it to me it looked like it touched the left hand of harms okay but of course and i'm gonna say i'm no good no touch no touch uh, there we the go safe route, just, just fading me. That's a safe bet today. I'm over two. We'll take another look from the other angle. Back with hand. Ooh, it yeah, would be okay. the so, left hand of Harms. Yeah, it would if, be, it if it were anything, it would be the left hand. So don't even look at the right side. Look at the left. This is the longest replay, though, that the yes. table has taken on this challenge. But point one. Check out the North Dakota State bench. They are no care Run, in the world. Fire. You wouldn't even know that they're in the middle of a fifth set of a Summit League tournament game, a chance to play in the NCAA tournament, and it looks like this one is going to stand, so the point will stay with the Coyotes. And they do. That's They're all good. So Madison Arms, no touch. Leanne Williamson, she's smiling. Oh, yeah. She likes it. Yep. Leanne Van in attendance. <laughs> They're Every geared point. up. Here we go. First to 15 in set five, all even at two. Two sets apiece for these squads. Kelly Johnson has set. Quick spike. Allie Barth. The quick kill. The silent kill. Allie Barth, the sophomore, gets sophomore. it done. Unbelievable. Just the underclassmen of the Bison. They're young. They're going to be a contender for many years. So now it looks like... Morgan Middleton will step in and serve. Seelock will receive, serves it long, sends it long. Henze sends it back with two hands. Put back, get the kill. That is smart. Upperclassman there, Henze, too good. Just avoids Madison Harms. Also, good thoughts there. Henze, the double-double, 15 kills, 13 digs. Big answer from the Coyotes. Elena Wolf will check back in. Evelyn Diedrich will take a breather. We talked earlier, Darren, that this had the makings of a great five set, and it has delivered. Four seed and five seed in the Summit League. There's Elena Wolf to serve. Quan will receive. Johnson, the set. Hensy denied by Ferris. So try it again. Ariana Bloom will count it. Ariana Bloom delivers. The freshman coming up big in her first bit of postseason action. Put back catches that outside line. Our officiating crew has just been spot on with the calls. Here come the Yotes now. Harms takes a little off. Hinzi will get it over. Seelock will deny. Now here comes Harms. Was there ever a doubt? 
Madison Harms would step up here in the fifth set. Oh, just so good. Gets denied the first time. Pick it up defensively. Madison Harms not afraid to swing and swing big. Ava Schmall, the senior from Forest Lake, Minnesota, couldn't quite corral it. We'll try again, the Bison. Quan, the bump set. And the dig no good there by Avery Van Hook. Another kill for Allie Hinsey. Allie Hinsey. Van Hook was on the line, and Hinsey was going wide. So either that ball was going to be touched point Bison or out of bounds Hinsey and point to the Yotes. Hinsey takes the, bison the flat footed serve. Seelock will save it from the scorer's table. And Van Hook, just a huge mistake there, sends it right into the net. Careless mistake from the junior. Bison up by two. So now, North Dakota State takes a two point lead. Can the Coyotes answer? Here's Van Hook to Seelock. Blocked, but Seelock gets it back. Now Van Hook again to Lotion. Seelock saves it. Van Hook will try it again. Seelock. <laughs> Third Nine. time's the charm. Oh. Kylan Seelock, breakout year. Big point. All these passes are coming inside the 10 foot line. The hitters have literally a one step drop just to transition, just to keep be themselves behind the ball. Too good from the Yotes. Maddie Johnson, the senior, will step back and serve. Juan will receive. Johnson will set. Boom. Will boom. Let's go, the freshman says. Let's go. Jennifer Lopez loves it. <laughs> the pocket of Bison <laughs> love it. They're holding up their Kelly Johnson faces. How can you not love postseason sports? Van Hook will set. Seelock will get it over in no man's land. Gets the roll to go. Soft middle. Both clubs really elevated. Just tuned in, dialed into what's happening on their side of the court. Ring around the rosy on the <laughs> South Dakota bench. <laughs> it's all fun and games. <laughs> Yokes down one. Top setter in the league will, a server, excuse me, will do will do just that. Here comes Lauren Jansen. She's denied. Seelock will set it up for Van Hook. Van Hook will deliver to Palman. She's denied. Now here comes Johnson with a dump. The savvy Too senior. Good. Center of the year. There's a reason she gets kills from that. It is disguised. I am fooled. Which is what every single time. I think the ball is gonna go out to the hitter. She's gonna quick middle it. No, quick dump and then a quick look. She's so good. Kelly Johnson is at that. Now Johnson will serve. Big receive and now it's a free ball for the Bison. Here they come on the attack. Alexis Bowling won't be denied. Alexis Bowling, another kill. She's got ten. The Bison are the first to eight. We'll switch sides in this fifth set. Eight to five, set five. Alexis bowling with no regard for human life. <laughs> just opens up, just catches the hands to of Maddie Johnson. I think she was trying to get out of the way and just coming the, the ball's coming too fast. Bowling has had a night. I wonder, they really should start tracking hit speed in volleyball. I think that would be a great a step. Yeah, get a little, like, you know how they like do, baseball? uh, yeah, like Those they pitchers. do, uh, uh, exit velocity in there baseball. You there you go. They do, like, you know, they'll, they'll track how fast a football player was running in next-gen stats. I think the evolution of volleyball will be, because some of these shots are just unbelievably strong. I always like the stat, too, Darren, of, like, the intangible. The people that don't get the kills or the assists or the digs, but they're the journeymen that are on court that make your team better because they communicate. They call mine, mine, mine. Go, go, go. They get to the line and they, they're letting their teammates know, hey, that ball's in, that ball's out. Let's go, let's go. They're just that good all-around player. They don't load the stat sheets, but they do all the little things right that just make volleyball fun. And this game is all kind of fun. If you are a Bison fan, 8-5 on the switch. You got to be happy with that. 16 kills for Ali Hindi. 11 for Alexis Bowling. 10 for the freshman, Lauren Jansen. 
and make him feel it. The bison, the energy is high. Jennifer Lopez, she's won this tournament before. She's trying to do it again as a head coach. Here we go after the switch. Bryn Palman denied there. The set from Hinzi. Bowling will just squeak it across, and Cameron Ferris is there. Here's Evelyn Diedrich, cross court, long. Taylor Kwan will dig. Kelly Johnson will set it up for Hinzi. He'll push it across, but Manny Johnson's there. Now Van Hook to Diedrich, cross court. Kwan is there. Now Johnson, the set up. Bowling, the spike, the kill. Bowling, put your fingers in the sky. <laughs> the right side is just lit tonight. Bowling is just a powerhouse out on the pin. 12 kills for Bowling on 24 swings. Here comes Bobbin, cross court, tight rope, count it. Needs to happen, Bobbin needs to put the ball in, she does. That brings her teammate, Madison Harms, back into the game. South Dakota needs to get a point here on their serve to keep pace with the Bison. Brooklyn Schramm will check in as well, so step back and serve. Uh, Over the net, uh, Hinzi will receive. Johnson will set. Bowling will spike. She delivers. FedEx, Alexis Bowling. Guaranteed, Alexis Bowling was probably not the first choice when you've got a hitter like Allie Hinzi on the left pin, but I'm telling you, that is all kinds of good from the right side. Bowling is here to play. This fifth-seeded Bison squad has been through it all. They come into this game on a three-game losing streak, and now they can feel it. They're four points away from advancing to the second round of the Summit League tournament. Leanne Williamson wants a timeout. We'll stay here with the action. The Coyotes backs against the wall now. Down a five, 11 to six here in this fifth set. So, Coyotes need to clean up service even. Not as sharp as it has been, Darren, coming off that Bison serve. And give the Bison credit. These float serves that they are giving the Yotes and Covenant all kinds of tough. And you have to have a high quality first pass so you keep your options open. Van Hook needs to know what options I have. And just going out to the right, out to the pins, that's predictable. The Bison, keep the pressure on. Put your serve in because your defense is strong. It has shown that you're able to transition well you know, on the offense, but the Coyotes need to score and get that side out point. Otherwise, this game could get away from them quickly. USD has been tough to beat in their place. Nine and two in the Sanford Coyotes Sports Center this season. The Bison just three and four in five set matches. They were one and three in the month of November, what? playing for their lives, playing for their season. Four points away, Madison Harms, Ali Hinzi, Kelly Johnson, three of the top players in the Summit League, but someone's gotta go home. Here come the Coyotes. Van Hook will set it up for Diedrich. Cross court, she's blocked, Harms is there, but Kelly is there on the dig, bowling. Soft and Ferris will dive. And save it. Deidre cross court. It's long. No touch. No touch by the Bison. 12 6. I like the Yotes, though. Dietrich still swinging. No one's going into tip mode. The Bison are three points away. Here come the Bison. Lauren Jays. The freshman with the ace. The freshmen for the Bison are incredible. No time like the present. Lauren Jansen delivers. The Bison can feel it. They're two points away. Timeout, Coyotes. And the Yotes are feeling the pressure now. It has been the evening, Darren, of a freshman volleyball. The underclassmen for the Bison have been tough. Just all kinds. And senior leadership by Kelly Johnson. I mean, just to be able to distribute the ball the Coyotes really just got out of system, and volleyball is a game of runs and spurts, and right now, the Bison seem to be in control of set five, and maybe the match. One ace for the freshman, excuse me, two aces for the freshman, Lauren Jansen. That one couldn't have come at a better time. Ariana Bloom 
firing up the fans, firing up the bench. She's also a freshman. She's been huge today. Nine kills, six blocks, 12 points contributed for the Bison today. They sit two points away to the Bison. One in three of the month of November, a three-game losing streak coming into this matchup against the reigning Summit League champs. And Maddie Johnson, another ace, another ace for Lauren Jensen. Maddie Johnson couldn't handle it. And now the match Bison point. are on match point. Here it comes from Jensen. The reception, the setup, harms, the touch, and it's in. Bio's gotta go to work. Harms isn't trying to go home yet. Does, does South Dakota have another run in them? They'll need it. The Bison need just one point. Avery Van Hook will serve the lefty. Here we go. Match point. Johnson to Hinty. Did you ever doubt it? Allie Hinty ends it. The run is over. 